Here's Ian Poulter. He's known as one of the best pressure players in the game of golf with all his great Ryder Cup performances. And one of the reasons is he has a very repeatable golf swing. He tries to do the same thing over and over and over again. Basically plays a straight ball or a little bit of a cut and he just does the same shot every single time. As you get to the top of his swing, you're going to notice his club is pointed to the left. You aim two times in your golf swing, once at the beginning and again at the top of your swing. Notice here that Ian's club is pointed to the left at the top. The great thing about that position is it will always allow you to get the golf club down in front of you much, much easier. When he comes down into the golf ball, he is in an absolutely great position right here. If you notice where the club head is. It is right on his hands. That is what is called getting the golf club down in front of you. If he had the golf club stuck behind him, it would be over here somewhere. And that would mean the club would be coming too much from inside to play a straight ball or a little bit of a fade. But this is a great position and it's easier to achieve that position when you have the golf club pointed left at the top of the swing. So the takeaway though for amateur golfers is at the top of his swing, his club is pointed to the left. That's where you'd want to be if you're trying to fade the ball. If you were trying to draw the golf ball, what you would want to do is you would want the golf club pointed more over here. The golf club pointed more to the right at the top of the swing would allow you to come more from the inside. So there's two different points of aim. Remember, you aim at the beginning, you aim again at the top. Where you aim the golf club at the top of the swing will have a lot to do with how you bring the golf club down and what kind of shot shape you're trying to hit.